Last week we published the final video of our four-part series of Tommy Fleming in Rwanda, which can still be seen on our social media platforms. However, we have one final video to thank Tommy from the bottom of our heart. In the first instance, agreeing to come to Rwanda with us was a huge commitment. He was just about to start work on his own album, Voice of Hope 2. We know how generous Tommy was in giving his time, but the generosity didn't just stop there. Uh, when we got to Rwanda, Tommy really got invested in the Boer project. We were walking into a very sensitive situation. Uh, we had met some um, families with terrible, tragic stories. For instance, one lady in particular, she had nine people in her family, but during the genocide, she lost her husband and five of her children. But Tommy's sensitivity when he met her and his understanding and his, uh, and his care and love, really, that he showed to her was second to none. Tommy really got the horror of Rwanda. This tiny country, around the same size as Munster, was gripped by a genocide that saw, in 90 days, almost one million people killed. All of this, at the end of the day, is creating awareness for the terrible hardships that are still felt in Rwanda. There are people still living in incredible poverty and we're trying to reach them. And we do this by donations of gifts of cows, goats, chickens, pigs and AI straws. We are seeing the lives of recipients out there, uh, the people who have received animals from us. Um, they, their lives are changing, they have hope, they have a future. So finally, Tommy, thank you for your friendship to Bohar and thank you for your friendship and the love that you showed to the families in Rwanda. And because of this and because of all this promotion, you are helping those families that extra little step into hope.